We got a first look at these new Union Dunks. This is the second colorway that we have now seen online. This was the first one right here, which um, a lot of you were really digging. And now we have this second one right here. Um, let me know. Uh, actually, let me do a poll. And um, we'll do, you know, one or two. This would be number two right here as far as um, which one do you guys like better. Let me set this poll up. While I do so, let me play an intro. And if you're watching on the playback, just skip um, 30 seconds, if even that. All right? Boy, Young Jizzle, nigga, y'all know what it is, man. DJ Dells. Peace, man. What's up, y'all? This is Common, and right now you're checking out DJ Dells. Stay in tune with him, all right? DJ Dells, absolutely wonderful. What it do, what it does, the kid. Mr. R.I.P. himself, low so, in case you ain't no so, rocking with DJ Dells. And then with it, y'all, it's your boy, Neighborhood Nip. Big shout out to my homeboy, DJ Dells. No question, Neighborhood Nip. Dells, Red, man, I'm in the building. Let's get it. All right, so let's see what the chat got to say when it comes down to this second colorway. I think I may like this second colorway better, guys. I'm going to be honest with you, uh, but let's see what the chat got to say quickly. Richie Stockman says shoes fire right there. Yes. Keegan says, yeah, it is. Richie Stockman says unions for me are so hard to get. I think for everyone, bro. Hit that thumbs up button too right away as you as you walk in here, please, and on the playback. It helps the performance of the show. We don't get the likes up. YouTube hides the videos, and that just sucks. Do it for the love of sneakers, baby. E-White Design says, word. E-White says, what it do? What it do, E-White? And E-White, I will be on Caffeine TV, just like a lot of you all that enjoy that show, at 7 o'clock p.m., which is in one hour exactly so I hope to see you guys there. Caffeine.tv backslash DJ Dells. I'll be playing music, new and old, and showing you sneakers um, from the collection. Uh, let's see. No Name Misfits, my guy. Jake Ryan. What up, broski? Good to see you in here. Hopefully we'll get Jonesy in here. I think he's MIA right now. He says, these are no, these aren't off-whites. These are the, the um, these right here are the unions. So we have this colorway, and I, there is a little video I'm going to show you on them. And then we have also this colorway, which I showed you guys last week, which you may want to watch that video because we get pretty in detail with um, that right there. Um, both very nice. Both are very nice in my opinion. But um, And this is the first colorway. So if you're voting, this is the first leak. And now we are at the second leak right here. Let me know which one you actually prefer, because I definitely want to know your opinions. Um, it's important. Your opinions effing matter. Rest in peace to um, my dude, man, right here, man, Luke Harper, a.k.a. Uh, Brody Lee, man. I still can't believe he passed away. Very sad. Um, this is the packaging, by the way, for these shoes, which looks pretty cool, courtesy of J23. Um, I like it, man. I like these a lot, a lot, a lot. But I have a lot of baby blue, and this is a little unique right here. So um, I like these too, man. The colorway is unknown. The threading is loose, it looks like. Um, you have a little bit of this green image on the outsole that you can see. And um, that is what we got for that but there is also some video right here so we'll show you some quick video while we just kick it and hang out um let me see who else is in this chat right here and let me put a link if anyone wants to cam up um i think these are way better that's that's just me bro that's just me but let me know what you think leave it in the comment box below and, um, I mean, th these are not bad. It's not like they're bad. They're, they're dope, too. You know? It looks like Union's going to be hitting hard 
in 2022 because you got two dunks and then you've got these also. So there's like a lot going on with Union because we got this coming out and there should be two colorways of these twos. And we got a lot of twos coming, you know, from all different types of collaborations. We had the off-white joints and now we have uh, these that should be hitting retailers in 2022. And then now we have this from um, Union along with these right here from Union, which is, it's exciting. It's exciting to see all of that. Let me text Joe, see where the hell he's at. Um, let's see. Let me text Jones and everyone else. We live on the Sneaker Addict. Okay. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let me see what the chat got to say. Um, who did a better dunk, the union or the off-white? What do y'all think of that statement? Who did a better dunk, the union or the off-white? I think they're both really dope. Um, I, I mean, I got to see these kind of – I got to see more of these. It's kind of hard for me to go there with it, right? Uh, because, look – when I first seen the off-whites, I wasn't that impressed. But then I, when I realized how they were releasing them, I was very impressed. How it was like a mystery. It was like a mess. It was it was a mystery box. So to me, that was pretty exciting shit right there for it to be a damn mystery. And I think a lot of people enjoyed the fact that you didn't know what you were getting with the off-whites. It was a surprise. Um and even trying to get them was was interesting all in all. The colorway of this new one allegedly is Midnight Navy. That's not factual, but that's what I'm hearing. Um, Midnight Navy is the actual colorway of these. Uh, but, you know, <laughs> I'm trying to look for something else, too, to talk about. Um, let me see. This is something I definitely want to talk about. I need to set up. Let me set this up really quickly. Uh, but yeah, continue to let me know how you feel about these shoes, please, because it's important. Um, that's the focus of today, which colorway you guys like better when it comes down to these off, I'm not off-white, damn it. You, you got me saying off-white now. When it comes down to these damn shoes, uh, these union dunks right here i'm curious to hear your opinions on all of that so let me know now i'm curious to know your opinions on this too if it will show oh i gotta go to my profile how do we feel about this right here this should be the final chapter for these waves um some are calling them the monarchs this is a metallic and black shoe. Um, how do we feel about this colorway versus the other three? Are we feeling these or they're okay? What what what's your where's your head at with these right here? Where's where's your head at with these? Is this something you gotta have? They release on the tenth, by the way. They will be dropping on the tenth. So let me know how you feel about these. I definitely want to know. Um, and I'm about to check your comments in just a second. And leave comments if you watch on the playback, please. Uh, you know, the comments is important. It's absolutely important. Your opinions matter. They do. For real, for real, for real, for real, for real. I think that this, this is a dope shoe, but I got to see him in person. Uh, man, the materials are on the off-white collabs is what got me hooked. First photo leaks always get me, um, give me a bad taste because I don't realize the level they are made. But unions are dope for sure. Yes, I agree with you. I do agree with you 100%. So, yeah, I, I dig this shoe. Um, let me know how you guys feel about that. And let's also go to the Nike launch and I just want to see what's going on here, if there's anything new 
which um, it doesn't seem like there's much going on. Of course, we've got this monster release of the damn uh, cool gray 11s, which everyone wants on the 11th. I mean, they report there's so many pairs being made, but guys, don't sleep on these cool grays. Just because they made tons of pairs, it doesn't mean that it's going to be a walk in the park to buy these things. Um, because then you'll hear later on when the release happens, this December release, oh, I thought it was going to be easy, and it wasn't, and this sucks, I wanted them, and da-da-da-da-da-da. And, and it's always like that every year. Um, and then some people say, oh, this was easy. This was the easiest thing to pick up ever. Um, I think the blue potters were the best ones. That's me personally. Um, Because it had the wave, and it was blue. So, you know, you have the wave, it's blue, that's wavy. That's just my personal opinion. Once again, don't forget, we're going to be live at 7 o'clock on Caffeine TV, 7 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. That is less than an hour away. Um, I have a link in the chat right there, caffeine.tv backslash DJ Dells. I hope to see you there. We'll be playing music and digging through this wall and showing you guys a whole bunch of sneakers. So come hang out with me. That will be in less than an hour. Um, definitely do so and share these videos. Please share these videos because um, we got to get we got to get these out there. Definitely. Um, let's see if they added anything else because I don't want to recycle what we did yesterday. We really dig through this. But we didn't really talk much about this shoe. And I know Jones really wanted to speak about this. Um, how do we feel about these dunks right here? These championship gold rods. Are we into these? Is this a must cop? How do we feeling? La Shuta. What up, man? Good to see you in here. Flaming, where you been all my life, man? Stuck at work again. Ah, uh, he says... Get that overtime money. I ain't mad at you. Get that bread, brother. Get that bread, you know? Shit. But, yeah, I, I actually do dig them. And um, I also know one more time, because I know people are just walking in here. Um, we showed you these last week. This is the first colorway we've seen on these Union Dunks. And now we have a secondary Union Dunk right here. Which colorway do you guys like better? Let me know in the chat. Let me know in the comment section on the playback. And also, please let me know. Let me know in the... Um, what the hell am I doing? I did say chat. Okay. I'm, I'm bugging. Excuse me. It's been a long effing day. Um, and I say that all the time. But it just... It, it's, it is a, been a long fucking day. <laughs> Never misses. Never misses. Not a must cop, but I like. Okay. No doubt. I respect that. Uh, give me 30 seconds, please. Boyfriend cheated on me, so I ran over his shoes. This is painful to watch. Does this person... God, you see the slow motion? Oh, God. Does this person have the right to do this? Destroy someone's property because they cheated? I want to know. Leave it in the comments. Subscribe if you're new. And watch more videos here. God, this is horrifying. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to sleep tonight after seeing them beautiful sneakers destroyed. Not the Dornbeckers. Not the Dornbeckers. Not the Black Cement 3s. <laughs> <coughs> I still, that's a trip right there, man. Broad ran over the damn shoes. She got so effing mad, huh? But yeah, it looks like people are kind of just whatever about these, you know? Um, they also put a hold on Travis, on the Travis Scotts. Yeah, um, we know that, that happened a few weeks ago. Unless it's something else. What shoe are you talking about? Exactly. Maybe it's something else. Um, I noticed today they were doing this preview also on Nike on sneakers app. It was supposed to be at three o'clock Eastern time. And I kept checking and then it said something like they're postponing it, but did they really postpone it or was it just late? 
I think something happened with the bots, maybe, where the bots were attacking the fucking stream. Did y'all hear about this today? Let me know in the chat. I'm curious to know. They can't even do no damn streams without these bots hitting up that sneaker site, huh? That's where it's at now? Shit. Let's see what else we got. Um, we talked about a lot of these right here. Um, this shoe, I think, in the long run is going to have a vibe like the biohacks. But I like the biohacks better than these. Fly Ming, my guy. Great to see you back in here once again. Make sure y'all hit that thumbs up, please, too. Should have put heavy suede on those union dunks. Let's look at those union dunks again. I run off the chat. You guys talk, and I run off of what you guys are talking about. That's just basically how it is. Um, yeah, I mean, it's got like, it looks like a, almost like a, a fuse kind of material, right? Like, is it like a plasticky kind of fuse material? Kind of looks like that. When I look up close, like almost like a rib stop uh, material right there. Who is this? G. I'm not letting G. Let me see who this is. Let me entertain this. Yo. Yo. Okay. This is some. Yo. Oh, I got him out. Too late. I don't know who that was. I seen G, so I don't know who that is. It may be Gigantor. It could be. Um, yeah, heavy duty rib stop. That's what it looks like. Um, oh, it's G Fish. Come back in here, G Fish. I didn't realize who it was. Let me send the link there and put the link here. Bang. My bad. I seen like like a, no photo or nothing that I there we go there he is oh he got a treat for us oh here we go it's a treat sneaker treat let's see what we got here oh yo turn your camera the other way you got to put proper respect on there turn your phone to the side the other side so it's widescreen there we go wow okay. We got to change the title of this. Holy moly, guacamole, as Nori would say. CDG phone posits. Wow. Oh, my God. How's the leather on those? Can you speak or you can't speak right now? Oh, they got music playing as copyright. Okay, how's it? Okay. The leather. Wow. Look at that. I've never seen them yet. Hit the thumbs up button. This is this is what I'm talking about. I love the branding on the back. Those are badass shoes. What was retail on these? Put it in the chat again. I forgot how much retail. Can you show them a little more, brother, if you could? <laughs> I think I don't know what happened. Maybe maybe um, uh, his boss caught him or some. Okay, <laughs> always taking that out. So that's the insole of him. Wow, this is exciting. I forgot he said he was copping these. There's both insoles. I will say, man, for the money that that cost, they could have gave him a nicer box. But you don't wear the box. Sh show the um the the shoe more if you would, if you could. Just like the lateral side, yeah. Let us absorb that shit. Wow. Yeah. Stay still for a sec. Let, let our eyes absorb that, if you would. I just love the grooves on that thing. Do you think that let me ask you all a question, guys? Do you think that this has rejuvenated phone posits? Like, do you think this has rejuvenated the phone posit hype 
or no, it's all about this one right here. Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the chat. I definitely want to know. And hit that damn thumbs up button for G Fish coming through, representing heavy with them exclusives. That carbon fiber shank's tough. Black outsole. But I love the molding. The molding is what does it for me, man. That design, something new. What does the molding remind y'all of? To me, it reminds me of like um, the bottom of the shoe, kind of. Like the sole, almost like. What, what does it remind y'all of? 520. Okay, 520. All right. They got they was free for goat. Okay, so he won these through goat during that Black Friday thing. This is the first time ever seeing someone actually winning shit on Black Friday, also. Show the outsole. Could you do that in a second? Oh, yeah, what is yeah, should you, yeah, do that, do that. Forget about the outsole. Show the tongue actually, whenever you get a chance. Like, yeah. So they didn't do nothing different on the, the air. Um, cased in branding right there, I see. That, yeah, I see. I would have expected them to do like maybe a leather pull strap, you know? But I think the reason why it costs so much is they had to remake all of these moldings for these foam posit shells. You know what I'm saying? Because they're, what they're doing is they're making this molding, and then they're they're it's it's a polyurethane material that's on a foam posit. Show the outsole if you would. Could you show the outsole one time? There you go. So the outsole is traditional, traditional outsole, right there, with your zoom, heron bone traction, one cent logo on the bottom. Pretty dope. Pretty dope. Um. But yeah, man, let us know how you feel about it. He says it reminds him of a vinyl record. Ham says it's thumbprints, fingerprints. Yes, I see that too on the upper. What do you guys see when you see this shoe? Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the chat. Man, that is super cool. Craftsmanship looks good. I've heard people complain about the craftsmanship glue issues, but they seem fine to me. Unless I'm missing out. Maybe there's something I don't see, but it looks pretty damn good to me. And um, yeah, man, pricey, pricey shoe, but super cool. I wanted these, but hey, I ain't getting it like that. I don't got the bread like that for that right now with the holidays here. That's a lot of bread right there. But he was able to get that. Salute to G Fish. G Fish, we're going to be at Caffeine at 7. Come through, bro, if you're free. All right? Thank you to G Fish, man. That was sick. That was effing sick, man. Shit. Did y'all like that? Yeah, we'll be. I'll be on Caffeine at 7 o'clock sharp. So make sure y'all come through to Caffeine. Um, I'd love to see you over there. And shout out to G Fish for sharing that because that was freaking awesome. Um, and once again, the topic today is do we like the first co-away of the unions or do we like the second co-away of the unions better? Which one do we like better? Right now, the voting has 67% on the second co-away. The first colorway has 33%. 33%. Um, we have, I put in the description a whole bunch of other shoes that you may want to get early um, or see the resale on. And we dug through that yesterday, like the patent leather Air Jordan 1s. We did a really good video debating on, are they too shiny? Are they too shiny? Do y'all think that? The Air Jordan pan leather is too shiny of a shoe. I'm curious to know your opinions. Do you think so? Leave it in the comments. Do you think that they're too shiny? Definitely let me know right now.
they look they look dope to me. They really do look dope to me. In my opinion, I dig them. But that doesn't mean you have to like them. That's just my personal opinion. I think they look pretty freaking awesome. Um, let's see. Let's see. Yeah, that was fire. G Fish did his thing just now, man. I'm happy. I was I was not expecting that. Um, and then also, you know, a lot of people are excited about this LeBron that'll be coming out shortly. Um, I like the LeBron 19, but there's many people that think it's dog shit, as Jones would say and others. How do you feel about it? Let me know in the comments, because I definitely would love to know how do you feel about them? Do you like them or not? Um, let me know. I think that this colorway, you know, this is not for everyone. That's for sure, right? Let's be realistic. This colorway ain't for everyone, but I like the silhouette a lot. I'm excited for the silhouette, for this shoe to come out and me to, you know, actually try them on. They, they're they very reminiscent of the LeBron, um, LeBron 9, you know, definitely kind of vibe of the 9. And I see some other stuff too. That it reminds me of also. But um, definitely the nine. Graham, I need you to DM me. Um, tweet, um, text me immediately. And just say, Dells, you needed me to remind you about something. I may have a, a really cool opportunity for you. Okay? Very cool opportunity for you. So text me, okay? ASAP. And just say, yo, it's a reminder. Okay? I may actually be able to get you some bread. So hit me up. And it has nothing to do with customizing or anything. Um, you will be happy. I, I think so. I think you will be happy. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Once again, let's let's um, go back here one more time because I know people just keep walking in. Um, that's just the way it is when we do the live streams and then maybe we'll dig into some other stuff um, Hit the thumbs up. Don't forget show that love super chat Y'all want me to break out a sneaker? Maybe try to ask me a question if you want and um, I'll try to do my best to answer it and show a pair of kicks um, And if you're watching on the playback always feel free to send them donations We we have a goal every month because I got to pay for this stream yard. I'm not even on YouTube It's just broadcasting from StreamYard, and I, I got to pay them every month, so keep that in mind. Um, do you guys like the first colorway that we seen last week, or do we like the second colorway better? Let's get that voting going and also write your opinions in the chat. We did see people say they wish it had nicer materials like suede. Um, this seems to have almost like a fuse upper or almost like a rib stop. Um, there may be lay layers of leather on the gray gray part of the shoe as I'm looking close up. It's a possibility, I think. Um, let me know how you feel about that. And then also, these shoes right here will be releasing this month. Um, I think this will sell out pretty quick. Perfect for the fall, but I'm good on those. And um, let's see what else we got. What about this Gore-Tex sneaker? How, how do we feel about this Gore-Tex shoe? We had one that released uh, not too long ago, and now we have these. Um, let me know how you feel about it. I would love to, to know. Give me um 30 seconds, not even. 30 seconds, give me. Let's go here. What song does Jay Z have that that makes you really think? I do anything. Yes, I do oh, okay. anything, anything yeah. for you. Sing it again. I do anything. Yes, I do oh, okay. anything, anything yeah. for you. Right, right <laughs> and, and, and that's a Grammy. And that's a Grammy. I'm pretty sure. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that, was, that was my Yo, that too. was incredible. Like... Sing it again. <laughs> There's a free free super chat for you right there. 
Um, I, re I replied back to you, Graham. So hit me back about that. Um, you know, let me know. Uh, let's see. He says, nah, I'm good. I prefer the Gore-Tex on my jacket. Yo, I found this Sockety jacket that I never wore. It's like a varsity Sockety jacket. And it's got leather sleeves. It's really, really nice. Um, and um, I'm probably going to sell it if anyone wants it. But it's not going to be cheap because I only think there's 10 jackets made. Um, but if anyone's serious about it, it's probably going to be... A, a, Probably going to be over about $300, we'll say. But it's a really, really nice jacket. It's a size large, too. Um, so if anyone's interested in actually seeing that, let me know. Just hit me up on my social media. But from my understanding, I'm pretty sure there's only 10 of those jackets made. And I just found it in my closet. And I just realized um, I'm... Um, I just realized that um, I need to get rid of some stuff. So let's go to something else real quick, guys. I just want to do a quick live. I'm going to be honest with you. And also remind y'all about caffeine because I noticed a lot of people aren't coming on to caffeine. And it's, and it's caffeine's dope because I'm playing music and I'm just literally just go ripping into the wall. You know, that's all I'm doing. I'm literally just ripping into the wall and, um, and showing you guys some of my collection. So you you want to go and check that shit out. Like for real. You want to go to caffeine at 7 o'clock. I'm, I'm telling you. You will love it. You will love it. Caffeine.tv backslash DJ Dells. Um, you may want to just click on that link and just sign up now. And then you'll get notified. Um, I'll put the link in the chat. And... You have to verify your account if you're new to Caffeine. And, and it's a dope site, especially if you're into, like, rap battles. And there's other people on there, too, like Soul Collectors on there. So check that out. That's the next wave right there, Caffeine.tv. Go over there and check it out. And I also do the music requests. And it's a, it's a shitload of fun. I mean, it's not even just fun. It's a shitload of fun. Um, you want to go over there. Trust me. Trust me. Have trust in Dells. Because I promise you, you will be happy over there. Because um, I'm I gotta set up for that in a little bit. Um let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's go to how do we I, I didn't even ask you. I could excuse me. Um how do you feel about this shoe right here? How are we feeling about this one? Do we like these or no? Are these a bag of shit, like Jones would say? How are we feeling about them? Definitely let me know how you're feeling about them. I don't mind them, but the thing is, it's 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 not the greatest colorway. This is something if I seen on sale, I would buy. I want to own one of these and experience what this LeBron 19 has to offer. Um, that's my whole thing. So I will eventually own a LeBron. Um, and, and that's really it with this. They got the sleeping bag thing. Like this legit looks like a freaking sleeping bag for Christ's sakes. What the? F what were they thinking with this? Does anyone like this shoe? I'm not gonna judge you. I'm not gonna judge you. Does anyone like like this? Does anyone want to buy this shoe? Does anyone even know what this shoe is called? Does any right in the chat? I have no effing clue what this shoe is called. All right, I or right what the shoe is called. Don't cheat. What is this shoe? What is this shoe? Sleeping bag. Facts. What the hell is this shit? 
This thing is crazy looking. This thing is freaking insane. Why are we, why are they doing, I mean, I understand what they're doing. They're trying to be different, right? They're trying to be different. And I totally get it. I totally get it. I mean, because you want to do different shit, right? But do they really think that people are going to like really gravitate to this and, and, and feel like this is absolutely something like super special? Like, like, did people really think like at Nike that this was going to be a big hit? This whole like thing that they've brought together with like these like sleeping bag kind of vibes. Um, let me see. There's another one here. This one's like a sleeping, like a campfire thing. You see, it says a shoe walks in, a shoe walks into a sleeping bag, stumbles into a puffy jacket, and then ends up with the hot chocolate and by the fireside. This kind of that, only better. Plus, it's only made with twenty with with made with um at least twenty percent recycled content by weight. I don't mind this colorway, though. I'm not going to lie to you guys. It's not the greatest colorway, but I don't I don't mind the colorway at all. Like, it's, it's not bothering me at all. Um, yesterday, we also took a look at the, um, the, excuse me, we looked at those bubble gum Jordan ones, courtesy of Sneaker Steez. And I want to look at these real quickly because we were talking about them lightly. And I, I realized I actually want to just like look at these real quick. Um, let me like his video and drop a comment real quickly. Because that's what we all need to do always. Make sure to um, subscribe to his channel. Let's see. So this is that shoe right there. We're going to take a look at together. Um, and I'll put the link to his video in the chat too. Let's skip around a little. We don't need to see the box. So there's the shoe right there. The materials look really nice on the shoe. I will say that. I think the materials look pretty nice on them. What do you think? It's all like suede and new bucks and we got lace 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 galore like usual. I like the wings logo. Look at the wings logo. Oh bring it down. There you go. I like the Wings logo. That's kind of cool. What y'all think of these? Let me know. Talk to me in the chat. Definitely talk to me in that chat. And talk to me on the playback. CP says he doesn't like the, the um, reflective part. Okay. Yeah, the, the color. The, see, that's the thing with me, Graham. Like, the colors are not really doing it for me. Like, that's, that's really what it comes down to. The colors are not doing it for me. Like, it's not like the biohacks, those things are sick. Oh, yeah, it does have Bubba Fett vibes. Look, I got a Bubba Fett Funko Pop right here, too. But it's a special one. You know why? Because it's autographed by him. How cool is that, right? Pretty cool. Never know what you're gonna see on the show. Comes with yellow orange laces. Orange laces may be a good move. Black laces. What laces would you guys go with? Let me know in the comments and in the chat too. Definitely would like to know. It's not a bad shoe though. It's definitely not a bad sneaker. Would you fish tag me in? Oh shit, that's a dope video he put together. Check out Gfish757 on um on YouTube also. He he shot a video of these shoes. It's really a nice video too. It's like really fucking dope. So check that out. 
Thank you, Sam, for the donation. First one of the night. He says, live is show, Dells. Love the ones and the patchwork threes. Thank you, bro. Let me um, play a promo. Let's turn up. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Stop it. Oh, watch how I do. Boom, 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 boom. What's good? What's good is Sam Surrey, man. Thank you for the donation, brother. I appreciate that. You're far too kind. Your biohacks are way effing better. Way better. I think I may have the biohacks like right here. Feel like I do, or maybe not. I thought I did. Shit! Damn it! I just seen it. It's always like that, right? Sneaker addict problems. <laughs> Once again, shout out to Ron G. Check out Sneaker Steez on YouTube. Just search Sneaker Steez. Um, and check him out. I also put a link in the chat so you can go check it out. Um, he's got a great channel. I love the channel. And he always gives me permission to do this. So, like, you know, share it and and give my insight on the shoe. So I think that's super cool. Um, what? He goes through it all. He's showing the tags, everything. I think the orange laces may take that to another level. I think it may. I think it may. It says it comes with some soul protectors. Hey, let me ask y'all a question. Um... Do you guys think that the Ama Manir th um, ones are overrated? I've been seeing that a lot on my timeline today. People are saying they're overrated. Do you guys think the Ama Maneers are overrated? Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the chat. Are they overrated? Because I definitely am curious to hear your opinions on that. Matter of fact, we'll actually take a look at that together. Let's look at them real quick. I'm on my ears. I got a few more minutes. If it'll ever load. And I'll put a link in the chat. I'm on near ones here. And if you're looking for them on StockX, there's a link right there and in the description. Look in the description. By the way, um, on this poll, 64% likes the second colorway better than the first colorway on those dunks. I'm going to end that poll because I got to get prepared for my um, caffeine show. I got to get my music right. Why is this not loading? Maybe I got to clear my cache. I haven't done that in a while. I haven't even restarted my computer in a while. Maybe I need to do that. Okay, so here they are. Are these overrated sneakers? Now, I'm beginning to kind of feel like they are a little overrated. Now, hold your horses. I know some of you guys are going to say, Dells, calm yourself. But what's so fucking good about this shoe, bro? Like, it's got like a little snake print on it. This shit ain't working this damn site. I could pull it up here. I have a photo here. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where are you? Where are you? I know you're here somewhere. Don't say I deleted it. Nah, there's no way I deleted that photo. No effing way. Um, here we go. So, 
I'm on Manier 3. There's so much going on with it. The suede, premium leathers. I'm hearing that the leather on this one is thin as shit, people are saying. They're not feeling the, 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 the print on it that much, that maroon print. They're just saying a lot of people are, are kind of just like saying it's 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 overrated. It's an overrated shoe. How do you feel about it? Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the chat. I think the three blows these shits away. Won't have yours till tomorrow. I can't wait to hear it. Both three and one are whack. Why is the why is the three whack? Explain. Please. I want to hear your opinion. I really do want to hear your opinion. What's whack about the three? Because, I mean, I have the three right here, and I can tell you what's not whack about it. But I respect your opinion, Solomon. You know that. You know you're my guy. You know I respect your opinion. But the one, I don't see what's so great about the one. I'm sorry. I don't see it. Now, this, I do. Suede on here. Nice suede here. You know what I'm saying? On around the toe, the A right there, the quilt. The quilt is dope. It's a fire shoe. Nike Air on the back, of course. I understand. I understand totally. But then this, it's like some fake snake skin kind of shit on the tongue. Crackles kind of leather, which... People aren't very impressed with. I don't know, man. I want to know your opinions on that. I definitely do. So I wish I had the threes, though. Okay, shout out to Ducati. Yeah, they're not using real snakes. They're not, they're never using real materials. I don't even think the the leather that they're saying it's leather. I don't even think it's really leather. I'm gonna be honest. It's fire in hand. Ducati says, "Okay." I mean, everyone that's cammed up and shown them has been very happy with them. Don't forget, guys, my sneaker attic T-shirts. Go get them. I'm wearing actually one of them right now. You could get that below. Go get yourself one. Is artwork designed by Dells. So get yourself one. Got to gotta let y'all know. He said in that snakes, that fake snakes can going to run off after time. Run off, run off. Yeah, rub off. Excuse me. Damn right. You're damn right about that. So, let me see what's going on here. Yeah, he says it's not real leather. When you break down the designs, the threes definitely has more dope details. But I'm drawn toward the ones. So is it a case where people just like the model of the one better? The silhouette of the one? Is that why people are jumping toward? People just like ones better than threes. Is, is that what it comes down to? Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the chat. Definitely let me know. Um, I'm about to get up out of here, guys. Um, do me a solid if... if Come to Caffeine at at um, 7 o'clock, sharp. Come hang out with me, all right? I'd love for y'all to hang out with me. I've, I've had a rough week, too, man. I'd, love, I'd actually love for y'all to come through and hang out, listen to some music. I'm going to dig through the wall, show you guys some some heat, and um, we're going to have a good time. And um, if you're new to the channel, subscribe, hit the notification bell, follow all my social media across the board. And um, watch more videos at the Sneaker Attic. There's so much great content here. You want to watch it all. All right. Everyone have a great day. Great evening. And I hope I once again, I hope to see you guys. I really hope to see you guys at seven o'clock here. Caffeine.tv backslash DJ Dells every Tuesday and Thursday, seven o'clock p.m. Playing music, taking requests and also showing sneakers. All right. See you later. If you're watching on the playback, click one of the boxes and watch more videos here.
Love y'all. All right? Be great out there.